were amongst the first in the world to integrate virtual surgical planning, the use of computers, navigation, uh, and certain guide stents that could help transfer a computer plan to the patient. And we were one of the first in the world to apply this to the spectrum of uh, entities that we see and treat. We were able to plan our reconstruction or plan our treatment prior to even getting the patient on the operating table. And it allows us to really precisely predict what our outcomes will be. And this has been an evolution over the last 10 years. In fact, many of my mentors, many of them who are partners now, helped really develop this and made this a new standard of care. And this continues to evolve. And our commitment to this is contributing to the science to help evolve it. Really not a day goes by that I don't use it in some shape or form, whether it be for complex implant placement or facial reconstructive surgery. What I'm now able to achieve with computer surgical planning, it's not hyperbole to say that as recent as 10 years ago, surgeons would even try to attempt it because they'd consider it too ambitious.